Good morning. It's Monday, July 1st, 2019. I'm Russell, and this is Rocky Road Devotions, a few minutes of help for today's journey. Our devotion today is entitled, Old Friends, and our scripture is 1 John chapter 2. Dear friends, I'm not writing a new commandment for you. Rather, it's an old one you've had from the very beginning. This old commandment, to love one another, is the same message you heard before, yet it is also new. Jesus lived the truth of this commandment, and you are also living it, for the darkness is disappearing and the true light is already shining. If anyone claims I'm living in the light, but hates a fellow believer, that person is still living in darkness. Anyone who loves a fellow believer is living in the light and does not cause others to stumble. But anyone who hates a fellow believer is still living and walking in darkness. Such a person does not know the way to go, having been blinded by the darkness. I love mountains. When we first moved from flat Florida to North Carolina in 2000, I could not get over how beautiful it is here. Within a week or so, we took a drive up to the Blue Ridge Parkway, and I was hooked. My congregation suffered because of my addiction. They had to listen to me preach a sermon series, I think it was 19 weeks in all, about the view from God's mountaintops. If you like mountains too, I have the recordings. (laughs) Truth be told, I was hooked much earlier than coming to Carolina. My parents took us to a campground on top of a mountain in upstate New York back in the 1950s. The clear, crisp autumn air in the pre-dawn, looking down on a Revolutionary War battlefield site near Elmira, New York, is a memory that never grows old. There's such grandeur and declaration of God's handiwork in those hills. They seem old, eternal, unmovable, and awesome. They're stamped with the mark of eternal hands. They're old and always new. That's hard to explain. It's much easier to experience. Driving to annual conference ten days ago, we came to that familiar point on I-40 where you can first see the blue haze-draped backdrop of layers of mountain shadows. I breathed deep and sighed, Hello, old friends. It's good to see you again. Did I tell you I love mountains? This mountaintop experience is one I've known many times in our two decades of living here, but each time there's a newness that rekindles my appreciation of what beauty God creates. And that's the connection here this morning for me in John's beautiful passage of the new but old commandment to love. This command, John says, is old because the beginning of God's scripture describes God's loving hand in creation and his joy in walking with those he made in his own image. And even when man became unloving in rebellion, God still loved, promising a redeemer to save. And for John, this ancient idea of loving became the new commandment when Jesus showed up and lived a perfect life of love with the ultimate loving gift of his blood for our forgiveness. For you today, take it from a mountain lover. There's no greater mountaintop than what happened on Mount Calvary. You chew on that as you hit the rocky road. Have a blessed day.